Yeah, hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. Still lots more Bowser's Kingdom to go, which I am happy with because I love this place. So I guess I will begin with, if I can, if I can lock onto it, Koopa Free Running beneath the keep because I'm starting it off with this in the parts and it could take me a couple tries to do the moves that I need to do so well, actually it went yeah it's over here wrong direction we're the rowing rafers <laughs> Just skipping the dialogue now. <laughs> Alright, regular cup at Bowser's Kingdom is a go! So how do we get all the way over to the start? In very quick succession. Well, prepare to long jump like you've never long jumped before. This is so, so much fun to do. This is probably my favorite Koopa free running as a result of this because we're we're literally doing speedrun tactics the whole way through. <laughs> oh shoot. And yeah, we're basically skipping as many of those power lines as we possibly can, assuming that, you know, they don't that they that they take us long I mean it takes longer to use a power line, excuse me, but don't mind me. Don't mind me, I'm just, just coming through here. Peach is hanging out over there too, by the way. Alright. Go, go, go! Um, I don't know if I took the most efficient route. It probably is not, but I'm taking this route anyway because I'm still in first place! Which is a good sign that I'm doing decently! Hey, I want to go to the left! <laughs> That's okay, there's probably some way to make that jump with some super fancy movements. And I think I can actually... No, I was gonna say... I think I can actually make the jump to the start, but I was like, no, no, wait, that's actually too, it's too low over there. <laughs> this one's just crazy. And a couple more stairs to go. We are... -ing. <laughs> oh shoot, I didn't want to do a hat roll jump. I wanted to just... Roll! I keep doing my hat throw again. Oh, well, I won. <laughs> Bowser's Kingdom. Regular cup is complete. Bro, fast blazing prize the here. Yeah, baby! <laughs> Alright, Master Cup is a go. Uh huh. Golden. We know the deal. We've done 50 of these already. <laughs> Alright, so still gotta think of the fastest route, and the fastest route will probably require many long jumps. Many, many long jumps. <laughs> I'm actually getting leeway on the Golden Koopa right away. That's nice. Uh, shoot. Yeah, I gotta. Oh, yeah, that was not efficient, but I was more efficient than the Golden Koopa, so ha on you! <laughs> At least at that moment in time, it'll probably find some shortcut I'm not aware of offhand. <laughs> Go Mario! Power line! I think I'm doing a little better this time than I did the first time. Uh, tried to angle the camera so I could get the <laughs> get myself set up nicely ahead of time, but no, it was like, no, you're not allowed to. I'm gonna bomb. <laughs> Why would you do this to me? <laughs> it just pops out as soon as I roll on over there. Oh, uh, we're still in first place, so we're okay. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure about being able to long jump those suckers. Uh, like, well, other than that first super long jump. Ooh! <laughs> it's just that this one is so much traveling in such a short amount of time. Well, I mean, it's still the longest of all the Koopa free running tracks, but. It's still a lot, a lot of stuff. And hat jump for the win, because I'm, I don't even know where Golden Koopa is at this moment in time. <laughs> Woo! This is probably the fastest thing that I should be doing. And then rolling up to the finish. New personal best on this save file. <laughs> and there we go. 
That one is just so awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, name there a bro fast blazing moon power moon moon power power master cop Bowser Kingdom. We're done! <laughs> Alright, so I guess I should take a peek see on top of the a roof on there again? Like, yeah, I just have to keep getting a Pokio to get on that roof. It's like I never clear out that roof area or that roof path. I should, oh, it's this! Oh, the, how do I get that then? Because it's not Pokio. <laughs> like the the Pokios, they do not they do not like the these blocks whatsoever. <laughs> uh, okay. So there's got to be something explosive to be able to open that up then. Somewhere around here. So if it wasn't on top of the roof, then it's got to be like somewhere along off to the side. Like I'm able to knock up ball into that, or something. Uh, does it have to do with getting something from the boss arena to that spot? Perhaps? I could battle UFO really quick and see. Whoa! I thought there was land there. <laughs> well, at the very least, I can do this taking notes challenge and get the coins on top of that roof, finally. Oh, careful, don't miss a note, because there's two rows of them here. Oh, three notes! Three rows, not good. Not good at all. Maybe I should be doing this. <laughs> Actually might be the better plan. Yes, much, much better plan. Oh, 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 shoot, 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 shoot. Ooh, ah! Yep, hat throw, definitely the better plan. Alright, so now in place of the statues of Brutals that were here, we get the moons taking notes with a spinning throw. And now, just before I forget them, because I've been flubbing so much stuff lately, we're getting these right now. Ha! Ha! Take that, memory! Take that. Now, I don't know if you get a moon for battling the UFO, but it'll be fun! <laughs> So let's go ahead and pile up. Oop, I say, let's pile up. I need a couple more here, if you don't mind. Yeah, not, not that. There we go. <laughs> Actually, I could probably do it with just one more, because I, whoop, because I could do like one hop up and jump out of it. Yeah, something like that. Pardon me, I'm just gonna get a heart or two. <laughs> All right, it's not gonna reset the boss or anything. It's not like, not like we're locked in as if it was the brutal battle here. It's just probably for some sort of decent bonus of some kind. Do not fear the spikies. Just go with the flow of the spikes. And two hits for victory. Oh, it does give you a moon. Very nice. Woo! I should have known, because there's two statues over there. Innovator in Bowser's castle. So wait, you're not with Bowser? Hmm. I thought you were with Bowser all along. There might be a second villain going on here. <laughs> Pl plot twist! Uh, so there's a key... ...somewhere... Oh yeah! I forgot about this. Climb... <laughs> climb across here. Yep. You can actually climb across... <laughs> ...little decorative banners here. In succession, they get that key and get yourself back. Just have a good time. Enjoy the sights! Whoa! Whoa! What the poop? What? Why didn't he latch on to the top at least? <laughs> well then. Oh, and there's still this. This is obviously still a mysterious being at the time. But we'll see what I can do about that when I put some more thought into it. <laughs> Alright. And we're off. Once again, maybe I should jump, like, much lower. Yeah, something like that, maybe. Like, they, they're jiggling all over the place, but the sticks are always in the same place, hitbox-wise, so they're not really that much to worry about, per se. Like, they look all jiggly and hard to time and stuff like that, but no, 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 there's... There's, there's a lot of left here that's going on. Uh, I'm just kind of jumping. I'm not touching the analog stick when I'm jumping or anything like that. Oh, this, the banner got in the way of my face. That's why I couldn't turn the other direction. Yeah, well, I could turn the other direction, but the banner's going to be in my way again. Eh, that's okay. Alright. 
jumping from flag to flag is a done. But you know what is not is done? <laughs> you know what isn't done? That moon in a block. And I, but I think I have an idea of how I'm supposed to get it. Um, remember that there were those uh, exploding bombs along this path here? Well, I'm gonna do the trick. I'm gonna do the trick. Yeah! <laughs> Yeah, I, I could have swore that there was some coming down through here, and then I knock them off across d through there, and yeah, this one right here. Whoops, well, you get what I'm saying. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> okay, so we have activated the bombs here, so I guess we are good. Oh, that's a good one, that's a good one. All right, so that's how you get it. What's in those other ones, though? Now that I, now that I know how to actually get these things bro blown apart. Off, <laughs> providing that I can get get these shots mastered here. Okay, just coins. <laughs> Actually, it's more like fireworks and not bombs. But I guess fireworks are kind of a type of bomb. Inside a block at the gates is a done. Woo! Uh, oh wow. Oh, you know, you know, might as well get peaches. Peach, because Peach is, Peach is hanging out over here. And I, I came here long ago, and we heard her going, Hey! Hey, I'm here! I'm here! Where are you? But I was like, nah, I'm gonna do it when I get all, when I get, when I come here and get everything all organized. So here we are now. Oh, Bowser's, Bowser's Castle. I think this is the first time I've come here on my own two feet. <laughs> I, uh, I, yeah, probably. Whenever it's just me, this castle is simply splendid. I agree. And a moon poem fell down from the sky. You should probably take it. Woohoo! Yeah! Peach in Bowser's Kingdom! I think I've been to every place in the world. Oh! But I forgot there are places beyond the world, like the moon! The moon! <laughs> By the way, I love her outfit. Classic kim oh, classic kimono fan. Boo hair decoration. <laughs> Perfection for Mar the Mario universe and Bowser's newest castle. Oh yeah, new dialogue over here. Might as well check this out. I am overcome by the subdued refinement. <laughs> what about you? Are you overcome as well, or are you just watering your buddy here? Just watering your buddy, okay. So, the rest of the moons of, of the uh, moon block variety, I guess, are hanging out around here. That's like near the tip. I don't even have to hoof it there. I can second courtyard warp it up. <laughs> At least I think, maybe. Um, yeah, it's like all the way on that far side where I snuffed out that torch for a moon. Oh, there's a key. Where is that? Uh, I see. Oh, I see! Okay. So I gotta do some fanciful movements here. Pokey will not help me here. <laughs> I'm trying to slow my descent by grabbing onto the wall there. And... Yes! Nailed it! Normally I see that you're supposed to do this by uh, grabbing that and then just dropping down on it from above. But I think that's the better method, actually. It's easier to time that. Stonewall Circuit. Also, it could be a race, if you think about it. So I could, circuit may be a double meaning. Because <laughs> it goes in circles. I don't know. Uh, actually. Let's just warp. Don't bother with the power line. Just warp. <laughs> the warping yeah, is a maximum speed running tactics. I got, yeah, I got that note before, right? Pretty sure I got that. Wait, what's that? What's that in the middle of nowhere? It's just... What? Oh, that's a power line! Okay, so then I gotta take... I forgot about this one. Yeah! I was gonna say, how do I get... And I was like, oh no, that's right, that's in the path of the power line. Woo! Glad I remember that, at least. And how am I missing so many purple coins still? <laughs> I'm sure there'll be another part of this place anyway, because I'm, I'm sure 
I'm not close to getting all the moons, especially when you look at this. 53, well, I guess I'm semi-close. 53 out of 62. Anyway, I'm gonna go hop on over here, because I think... Oh, actually, no, I could... No, yeah, that's right, I gotta go get a Pokeo to get on top of the roof, pardon me. <laughs> Don't mind me, you're just passing by. I know you're a guard, but you're not gonna be able to stop me, believe me! So many others of Bowser's minions have tried and failed. Don't think you're gonna be any different. <laughs> Alright, so what am I looking for down here? Oh, it's another note. Probably taking notes on the wall, probably? Yeah, taking notes on the wall. Probably, I don't know what it's called, but we're definitely taking notes on the wall. Ooh. Hopefully I get enough time to do this. Oh, yeah! Happy days! I had plenty of time. Or I just got very lucky. <laughs> I'm getting better at Pokio. Woo! Taking notes on the wall. But I think there's something on the other side, too. Because this isn't the side that I was going for at first, anyway. I was just going there to get a Pokio. Yeah, it's on the other side of that. I just ended up getting diverted when I seen the other note there. And I was like, oh, yeah! Anyway. <laughs> uh, oh, the hole in the wall. That's it. Mm. Mm. Needs to aim myself true. Oh. Okay, aim myself true. Dang it. Aim true. Ah! Yay! <laughs> okay, where's that gonna poop up to? All the way up there? Alright. Oh, I can't, I can't spring out of that. I actually have to release and then stick my nose into a different spot. I guess my body is just too close to the wall to do a springeting. Behind the tall wall, boke boke! And I get... Oh, oh yeah! I actually have to take this path back this time because... Um, remember the front gates are closed now? There's, there's no one to open them for us this time. <laughs> I don't know why they opened them for us the first time anyway, but... Probably shouldn't question the game logic. Anyway, I'll just take my Koopa free running route through here if you don't mind. And back to uh, the start. Alright, so there is the gates. We can now open them for ourselves. Make a little shortcut. Besides the pipe, of course. Whew. Yeah, but yeah, as you've seen, the main idea, as indicated by the pipe that was by the start here, was to get you to start working your way back from the top, hence why the timer challenges were ordered that way, and there were so many more moons at that area at the start, etc, etc. Anyway, let's get... Actually, do I have... I was gonna say, do I have to even Goomba stack this? I was thinking... Yeah, I don't think I have to Goomba stack to get up there. There we go. <laughs> I only needed the Goomba stack for that switch. But no, I don't have the Goomba stack to get get this this place. It's shallow... Or not, I mean, it's uh, low enough that I can just hop up here. Oh no, it's a bird! Oh no! I feel dizzy! Okay, so what's the range that the birds will fly away at as I approach? Okay, so it's about there, huh? Okay. So I'm gonna presume if I go to about here and throw my hat in homing attack, I'll be able to get this without throwing up everywhere, okay? Whoop! Yeah! <laughs> Small bird in Bowser's castle! Heck yeah! And now... I am stumped! <laughs> like, not sure where to go from here to collect stuff. I thought maybe there was something near the beginning? At, like, on, on one of the... Well, maybe not, I don't know, I was gonna say like a... Yeah, like looking around this area. No, I guess not. I thought there was something that you climbed on. Like those side poles at the beginning, but no. <sighs> Hint out! <laughs> Let's go. Well, there was something over near the beginning. Okay, we're done here. So let's see what this thing was at the beginning here, like I thought. So it was like... Back... Edge of something? One of these? Oh, because it's facing the other way. Oh, yeah. That's a sneaky one. Caught on the iron fence. See there? See, this one's facing towards the outside. This Bowser head here. 
But this one's facing towards the inside, inside, inside. All of them are on the inside. Except for that particular one over here, which is facing the other way. That's your hint. Can I put my hat on the other one? Yeah, I guess I can. Probably, there's a whole bevy of stuff you could probably get by throwing your hat on these, then, probably. <laughs> okay, maybe maybe just coins. Might not be that worth it. <laughs> Alright. So, our next place... I can I just... Probably. I was gonna say, should I just, like, warp there and then long jump to the next place over? I probably could do that. Like, get a different angle looking at... at this over here. Oh, that... Oh, yeah! I forgot all about this. This is like a whole other wing that you can only get to from the island in the sky. Oh yeah! Thank you for reminding me about this, Mr. Hintoad. At least I think this is the only place you can get to this wing. At least this is how I first found it. Let's put it that way. Uh, I don't think I'll need you. I think I'll need you, though. Eh. <laughs> I don't know which one has a bl has a something in it, but... Actually, I could probably just use that. How about this corner one here? Hello. <laughs> and maybe it's actually something above your head. Nah, it's not. Oh, don't shake me off. Don't worry, I'm, I'm just here to see the sights. Oh, actually, that's more towards... This this side instead, actually. Um, let me get on top of you, if you don't mind. And just take a peek. I was going to say, take a peek upwards. Hmm. Yeah, because it's like right up right around this area here. You're just supposed to slam this part of the ground or something? Or am I just supposed to kill you? <laughs> am I, just, I might just have to kill you just by ground pounding your head, because you don't really have anything to destroy block-wise otherwise, so let's try it. No! That was not it whatsoever! And if they just respawn, it's, yeah, it's just gonna make it seem kind of worthless anyway to kind of uh, 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 come on over here. Yeah, over here. Might as well just destroy all the blocks. I don't know what's what I'm looking for or what I'm doing here. I forgot all about this area, in fact, until I see it again from up above. So, we're gonna figure this place out together. Whoa, that was weird. Why did that camera just go whoop? Like a dynamic zooming feature. Oh! Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> I got plenty of health left for more... Abuse. Uh, okay, so let's probably just kill all the guys. It's probably as simple as that. Whee! <laughs> I think the easiest way to get out of the way is to do a little dive. Just crouch and then press the Y button. Yep. Whenever they charge up like that, you just kind of yeah, just get that set up. All right, I'll just kill them all. <laughs> I guess we'll find out now. Because they destroyed all the blocks anyway, so... They've ran out of usefulness! <laughs> it's not like that they're gonna be able to outright kill Mario anyway. We, we went through this before with that other one. Alright, got that one down. Okay, it was kill them all. Okie dokie, but was... No, that couldn't be the one, because there was... Yeah, there's the other... Or was it? Was it? Oops. <laughs> I was going to say, or was it that there was a, uh, exterminate the ogres? Okay, that was it. That's definitely it, based on that name. But yeah, I thought that there it was marking something over here, but maybe what it was doing is it was marking each individual ogre. And I should have just checked the map after I killed each one. Okay, let's see where this leads off to, because maybe there is a way to get there without using the, uh, the painting. I mean, the, the shortcut to it. Ah, so I guess you can just use that power line. Well, not so much a power line. <laughs> you get what I mean. Okay, so where is our next destination? Here, I guess. Oh, actually, I didn't realize that took me so long. <laughs> uh, wait, actually, or did I not stop the recording from last time? I don't think I did. Because, no, yeah, I took it, I was going all the way back, yeah, I, so, I, wow, I, I don't know. 
<laughs> so with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part when I continue exploring Bowser's Castle for hopefully purple coins. I'm hoping that the hints that I got will lead me to places that I haven't been before, and I'll also be able to get purple coins as a result of that, you know, because I got a checklist of things I haven't been to and whatnot. Ta-da! <laughs>